Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and um, I plan to talk a little bit more about some Linux distros and show you guys what it's all about. I know some of you are curious. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on it, but I will actually uh, do some um, checking out. Uh, it comes with the fact that I regularly have um, comments or have people that ask me about a specific distro, what they are. Um, a lot of people are not actually um, don't see or don't understand the fact that most of what everybody's asking me is simply a Linux distro, as we call them, or a specific, um, you know, bunch of user interface and software put on top of a Linux kernel to make it, you know, work like an operating system with a graphical user interface. So uh, one of them was their vanilla. There was uh, somebody was mentioning in the comments, uh, is that you know a game changer? Well, it's a Linux distro. It's uh, one of those gazillion Linux distros, and I will go through a lot of them. There's a lot to look at, and of course, give my own opinion of it. Um, and one tool that I wanted to show you guys that um, if you are thinking of dabbling into Linux distros and try some on your PC. The fun part about it is that pretty much every Linux distro lets you try it. You don't have to install it. So this is good because it doesn't mess up anything on your drive. And once you remove the USB thumb drive from your computer, you can go back to Windows. But there's a few catch in there. Uh, one of them is about the um, way that you need to booth USB ton of drives. In order for Linux distros, for most Linux distros to actually work, you'll have to actually tell your computer that you want to boot into legacy mode. That is a change in the uh, BIOS of the computer. Once that is done, it will see the USB thumb drive and it will actually boot from it for most Linux distros. So that's one change that you'll have to do. I'll actually show a little video about it. The other thing is to have the bootable um, thumb drive with your favorite distro on it and the ones I'm going to show you. Uh, you'll have to download a tool which is this one here which is the um, universal USB installer. It's at version 2.0.1.40 um, which is for a sorry on this um, website called pen drive Linux. So from here, you go down the page, you avoid everything else, and you just, when you see the Windows for the USB drive installer, then you, of course, will be able to click Download UUI right here, which will have a download of the USB installer. So this is what you need, universal-usb-installer-2.0.1.4 at this video, is this version, but it has frequent updates. Once you have downloaded, you run it, and you'll have this page. I'll show you how it works with an actual uh, USB th drive in the next video. So I'll download a distro, and I'll actually show you how to create your bootable thumb drive for use on a PC. It could be the main PC you're using. It could be another PC. Uh, what's cool about it is that, once again, you don't have to install them to work and use them. You can just boot from it. And if you like it, then you can dedicate a PC to a specific Linux distro. So I hope you like this added content. We don't talk about you know Linux that much. Uh, maybe some of the impression I don't like Linux, which is not the case. It's not that I don't like it. It's depending on what you do, it might not be useful for you. But it's definitely, if you're an enthusiast or want to try other things, it's kind of fun to just, you know, play around with one of the distros and, and see how they evolve over time. And at the same time, it gives you an idea if you can actually live with a Linux distro and, you know, find it all right. Uh, maybe some of you will go there when Windows 10 uh, is at end of support, but the majority of people, of course, will stay on Windows. That's the way it's always been, and it's pretty much the way it's going to stay. 
So anyways, more videos coming up. Hope that you enjoy and that uh, we'll be looking at some Linux distros from time to time at the same time. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching my videos.